starting this list of free and open source applications, we have Linkora, which is a fantastic app for keeping all your links organized. When you launch the application, you will be greeted with a clean, simple interface that is really easy to use. And adding links is quick and straightforward, you just tap and save. And to keep everything neat, you can sort your links into folders. For example, you might have one folder for work-related links, another for personal interest, and maybe a third for recipes you want to try out. And if you want even more control, you can create subfolders within these main folders. This way, you can organize your links exactly how you want. One of the best features is the ability to mark links as important. This means you won't have to scroll endlessly to find the link you need. Just mark it as important and it will be easy to locate. And if you have links that you don't need at the moment but you might want to keep, you can archive them. They will be out of sight but still accessible whenever you need them. Plus, you can rename your links to something more meaningful instead of seeing long, confusing URLs. Sharing links from other applications is also easy with this app's integration. And it even grabs images and titles from websites to keep your list looking tidy. And if you want quick access to your most used folders, you can add them to your home screen. Having an app like SDMade is like having a personal cleaning service for your Android phone. You know, over time, your phone gets cluttered with leftover files from applications you've uninstalled, old logs, and other junk you don't need. So an open source application like this one helps clean up all the extra stuff, freeing up space and making your phone run more smoothly. It finds and clears hidden application caches, you know, those extra files applications leave behind that can pile up and take a lot of space. It also removes unnecessary system files and old directories that are no longer needed. The app is ad-free, which is great because you won't have to deal with annoying pop-ups and some advanced features are available if you decide to upgrade, but even the free version does a great job. And one of the cool things about this app is its automation feature. It uses the Accessibility Service API to clear caches and perform other cleaning tasks across multiple applications without you having to do it manually. And this can save you a lot of time. And don't worry about privacy since it only uses the API for automation and does not track or collect your data. Oxio is a free and open source offline music player application that focuses on delivering a smooth and enjoyable experience. It has a modding design that follows the latest material design guidelines, making it look and feel fresh on your Android device. The app handles your music library with great detail, including features like disk numbers and multiple artists. It supports a wide range of file formats and ensures all your tracks play at the same volume with the replay gain feature. It does not have an inbuilt equalizer, but it is compatible with external ones if you want to tweak your sound. It has gapless playback, which means music transitions smoothly from one track to another without any interruptions. The app automatically displays embedded album covers, giving your music library a nice look. Also, there is no internet required. One common media playing application which is next on the list is VLC for Android, which is known to be a powerful media player app that is completely free and open source. It is also known for being versatile and can play almost any type of file, whether audio or video, and supports a wide range of formats out of the box. This application is commonly known for being a video playing app, but it also is an audio player with all the features needed in an offline music player application. So it is a fully packed two-in-one application. You can play local files, stream content from your network, or access media from network shares and drives. Its playback features include auto-rotation, aspect ratio control, and gesture controls for adjusting volume and brightness. It also includes a full media library and an equalizer for audio playback, sleep timer, playback speed, equalizer, creating playlists and so much more audio settings. And for watching videos, it supports multi-track audio, subtitles and closed captions, making it a great choice for diverse media needs. This application also has a widget for quick access to audio controls and supports headset controls for convenience. So as a media playing application overall, it provides a great user experience. Similar to Mint Calculator, which I reviewed in a recent video, Calculator U is also an open source application which is more than just a basic calculator. It offers both functionality and style with over 60 color themes to personalize its appearance. And for everyday use, it has a simple mode but if you need to perform more complex calculations, there is a scientific mode with all the advanced functions you need and with the history section which keeps the record of all your calculations. This is great for going back and reviewing your work without having to remember everything. The app also includes a built-in unit converter for various measurements so you don't have to switch to a separate tool. Overall, Calculator U combines a slick design with practical features making it easy and enjoyable to use for all your calculating needs. 
And if you love free and open source applications, here is a whole playlist of such applications. Open source apps are fantastic for so many reasons and you should incorporate its use in your Android smartphone usage. Leave a comment and let me know what you think of these applications and if you enjoyed the video, consider subscribing to the channel and also leave a like on it and as always, thank you for watching.